segment, it's me, Jamie Lynn. Today I'm going to be making bows. Now this is a really simple craft that you can do with anything you have at home. I hope you guys enjoy it. So next I'm going to show you how to make bows. Now this is a really simple technique that doesn't need much. All you need is different colour ribbon. I prefer to use quite thick ribbon for this but it doesn't matter too much. Now you want to cut quite a long piece of ribbon for this um, but you can see a bit later in the video how much. So what we need to do first is just hold it in our hands like so. So our thumb is holding onto the ribbon and we're going to trace the ribbon round the back of our hand, over the front of our hand, making sure that our thumb's holding both of those ribbons but we're also making sure that our fingers that we're wrapping it around are quite loose and I'm just going to go ahead and wrap it around another time and this just adds to the bow a little bit. Now keep your thumb firmly on there, we're just going to tuck the rest of the ribbon through the bottom hole in the middle of our hands like so and we're going to pull it all the way through as you can see here so it has to make sure that it goes through the middle now we bring it up at the back and we're going to kind of try to tie a knot into the bit that we've just tucked in through I hope you can see here this bit's a bit tricky but I'm sure you'll get the hang of it now we just pull it tight and it makes quite a, a nice knot pull it as tight as you can but make sure you give a little bit of room because we need to now slide it off of our fingers Perfect. So as you can see, the amount of times that you can wrap it around your hand, it makes the bow slightly bigger and it adds more frills to the side of the bows. Now what I like to do now is just add an additional tie to the back just to make sure that it doesn't come loose. And there we are, we have our bow. We can just tease the sides out a little bit there. And I'm just gonna go ahead and get some scissors and cut the bottom to make it look really pretty. And there we have it. A nice pink bow, really simple once you get the hang of it. I'm just gonna show you again with a different color. So we take the ribbon, we place it in our thumb we wrap it around our hands as many times as you like, remembering to keep our fingers quite loose so it's easy to get off afterwards. We pop it through the middle there, all the way through, and we lift it up behind. We bring it back forward and tuck it through to create a knot. And we pull it tight. After that, we can carefully slide it off of our fingers perfect and we can add an additional knot in the back to make sure it doesn't come loose And we can make the ends look pretty just with our scissors cutting those ends off once you get the hang of it they don't take a lot of time to make and you can use these anywhere you like they're so pretty you can make them as big or as small as you like perfect and now we have two bows thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it so here's the end result of my bows. They're so pretty and you can use them in any which way you want. You can pop it on presents and you can stick it on a headband and pop it in your hair or any clips you might have. 
you know, there's so many uses for these little bows and they're so simple to make. So if you make them at home, definitely give me a comment below and let me know what you've made. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and definitely subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos like this one. Also, check out my previous videos so you can see what I've been doing in the past couple of weeks. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, my little penguins.